Hi everyone, it's Maddie here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for today's video, we're going to be reviewing the Maddie Ziegler Morphe palette. I'm not sure how long this has been out, but I did buy it on sale on Black Friday, so I wanted to do a video on it. Um, I will insert some footage here of what the packaging looked like when I first got it. It just came in this paper box that looked just like the palette, except the back had a little message from Maddie. And then it was wrapped in bubble wrap and yeah, that's pretty much it. It just looks like this. I think the packaging is really pretty and it also came with a clear film when I first opened it. But here is what it looks like right now. So these are all of the colors that come in the palette. I like that you get some neutrals up here. You've got this row of really bright, fun colors and then you've got these darker, smokier looks at the bottom. It also comes with a variety of shimmers and matte shades, which I do appreciate. We've got some barely shimmery ones to some super glittery ones to just some regular matte ones. Um, even a couple of them just have a hint of shimmer in them versus some of them which are completely matte. So yeah, we're just gonna be playing around today. I already have makeup on when it comes to my face and my brows. So I will just be doing my eyes today, but I think I wanna play with this purple look, or this purple eyeshadow right here, um, and kinda just see what fun we can have. So yeah, let's get started. I've already primed my eyelids, um, and I'm just gonna go in with this little brush here, and I think I'm gonna start with something simple on my lid. So I think I'm gonna go in with this angel color right here which obviously as you can see i've used the palette before and i have used mainly neutral colors so i'm excited to try the like sparkly colors um so i'm going to start off with this angel color and just put that on my lid Ooh, it's like uh color shifting it's like a pink to purple shift you guys can probably see the difference i don't know if you can see the difference too well I'll be inserting footage just to show you it up close in like really nice lighting. Um, Cause I know the lighting isn't too great in this video, but this is really nice. It's like shimmery, but like subtle. It's not super duper glittery if you're not into that look. I chose to buy this palette because um, I am a Dance Moms fan, you know, I've always watched it when I was younger, even now sometimes, it's like a guilty pleasure show where I can just put it on and I already know what's going on and I don't need to listen too well. Um, and I just love Maddie Ziegler. I think she's great, she's super talented. And I know she's been into makeup since she was younger and so I was excited to see what she was coming out with. Um, I am just gonna start, I'm gonna buff out some of the color in this brush because I haven't washed it. And I'm literally going to just tap into this purple. This is called She Insists. And I'm just going to put that in my lid or in my crease. Um, and if you were wondering, I'm not going to be swatching every single one of them. If you want a video like that, so many people make videos like that. But today I didn't want to do that. I kind of just wanted to play with the colors see what we could do. I was originally going to do a holiday makeup tutorial for you guys using this palette, but I decided I just wanted to do a review instead and just show you what these purple colors look like. Okay, so that's one eye down. Um, and honestly, my initial thoughts, uh, there hasn't been a ton of fallout. Um, and this shadow is fairly pigmented. I don't have the best primer in the world. So it could just be, you know, like the foundation that I'm working with. Um, but I think these are fairly pigmented. Um, I would compare these to being maybe a step down from Jeffree Star Cosmetics because Morphe has a really good formula, but I feel like Jeffree's is just unmatched, whether you like him or not, you know, just his formula for his cosmetics are really good with eyeshadow and such. So yeah, but I think this is, pretty pigmented. It's easy to blend. It's not very harsh. Um, it's buildable, which I do like as well. Cause you've got to have a nice even middle ground from being buildable and being super duper pigmented, you know, want to make sure that I can build on it, but that it's not too sheer. 
I really like the way it looks right now. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna throw this purple underneath my eye as well. Take this smaller brush here, take the purple, and just blend on my waterline. I'm gonna get closer up so you guys can see. But I'm gonna go into this one now. Ooh, that looks really good. This lighting is like, I'm trying to, to work with it here, but I really like the way it looks. I think in the corner of my eye here, I'm gonna go in with Dancing Queen, this pinkish color, um, and just kind of put that in the corner as like a little pop of pinkish color to go with the purple. Ooh, that looks really good. And I'm sorry for the background noise, my siblings are partying it up today. We did Christmas with my mom today, which is why it's a little bit louder in the background. That is what the pink looks like with the purple. Ooh, girl. Obsessed. It looks so good. This honestly has really surprised me. I thought there was going to be more fallout, but there's really like none. Oh, there's a little bit right there from, um, from the eyeshadow, the purple eyeshadow, but that's because I used a lot. The colors are just beautiful. Okay guys, I'm gonna go finish putting on my eyeliner and my mascara and I will come back to you when my face is done. Okay friends, so this is the final makeup look. I wanted to do it really quick um, vlog style in front of my window so you can see the colors and everything. Um, but I think that this palette is really nice. Um, I did have some complaints with some of the shimmery, like, neutral shadows that I've used throughout the week, you know, just with playing with this palette. Um, they've been a little bit, uh, sheer and just the, sh the sparkle shows up on your eye, but not really the actual color itself, which I am not a huge fan of. But that being said, there is a lot of really beautiful colors in this palette that do shine through um, and that are really blendable, easy to work with. If you've never gotten a makeup palette before, I feel like this would be a good one to buy because I'm pretty sure A, it's on sale right now, <laughs> and B, um, it comes with lots of neutral shades, um, mattes, shimmers, etc. And then you've got that row of really fun colors if you want to experiment. If not, you don't have to. And then you've got some darker ones to smoke things out with. So it's really versatile, um, good for everyday and for fun looks like this. Um, but yeah, I would really recommend it. So thank you all so very much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you have any other questions or comments, please leave them down below. And I will talk to you next week. Bye.